welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing something really interesting. My friend challenged me that I should try to recreate this look. <laughs> It'll be kind of hard because I don't know if she, you know, what products she uses. And I spent like 20 minutes trying to get like the same colors uh, as this look. But um, so disclaimer, I'm not trying to look like Kylie Jenner. I'm just trying to recreate this look. I don't have pink uh, hair. Uh, I don't have a wig, but I'm just trying to, you know, like focus on the eye makeup. As you guys can see, I've done my foundation. I've done my eyebrows. Um, if you have not watched the how to uh, do your foundation video, you guys can go and uh, watch that before this video. But yeah, so let's get started. Hey guys, this is not easy um, at all because I have no idea about her shades, but I think I did a pretty good job. I've used one eyeshadow for the crease and I've used the same for the under eye. And um, okay, for the highlighter, I used a shade that is one skin tone lighter than my own skin tone because I wanted this to be more prominent and I've used a really nice highlighter. Um, so, you know, um, usually what happens is that people don't use foundation or like concealer under their eyebrows. Um, so you can't really see the highlighter, but you should. Um, so I have no idea if she has glittery eyeshadow, if she has shimmer, um, but I'm gonna use Urban Decay Moon Dust. And I, I love this palette. Uh, and I'm gonna use Element and Spectre. I'm gonna mix both of them and then put them uh, on my eyelids. So. The second thing I'm going to use on top of my eyelids is a metallic eye shade. Um, I'm going to go with this one and I'm just going to do it in the middle because I plan on adding glitter to the middle. Um, okay, my eyes are actually really sparkly. I don't know if you guys can tell, but they are. Um, and then I'm going to use this palette I recently got. Um, okay, I don't like glitter that much because it makes a big mess, so I might have some fallout which I'm going to clear later, but um, I'm going to use this one and uh, I'm not going to use this with a brush of course because you know like it gets really messy. So I'm just going to go ahead with my fingers. Wow, this is really pretty. What I've decided is that I'm gonna use like one palette for like one look because it gets like hard for you guys to you know go and buy like a lot of palettes. Um, this is an exception though because I just wanted to recreate a look. Okay. It was not messy. Okay, so let's look at the picture again. Um, I think she has a half liner, not a full liner, so I'm gonna go ahead and quickly do my eyeliner. Um... So I am done with my mascara and I'm also done with my eyelashes. We're gonna now move on to the contour. 
Um, so you know like sometimes people ask me why contour is important. It's because when you use foundation, your face is straight. There's no depth, there's no structure, there's nothing. So contour basically highlights your bone structure and you know gives your face uh, a little color, um, the perfect shape according to your face. So we're gonna actually talk about contour in the upcoming video. So right now I'm gonna use Too Faced Coca Contour. Um, I'm gonna use the medium one. So I don't think that we need this light anymore. Um, so I'm gonna go quickly and use this shade of pink for my blush. So with blush, make sure you're not just doing this part because you're gonna start looking like a clown. So one more thing that I'm gonna do before I forget is use an eye pencil so if I look up it's not gonna show my skin and you guys should always do this if you guys are using eyeliner I think she is using a very like subtle highlighter um I, I this is my favorite uh highlighter palette so I'm just gonna use these two shades and go very lightly You guys can only see, I think, my nose highlighter, but it's blended. And quickly highlight my and my lip. This might look like a lot right now, but then once you are like out. Blended. Okay, let's move on to the lipstick. This is the closest shade I have to whatever she's using. This is the Melted Matte Too Faced. Um, so after this, I'm gonna try to remember that I have to highlight my eyes as well. So she has some highlight going on. This is my recreation of the Kylie Jenner pink eye smoky famous makeup. Uh, I do wish I had a pink wig <laughs> to go along with this. So you guys, you don't have to follow what I do or what anybody else does. Makeup is art. There is no hard and fast rule. You guys don't have to follow us. Just do what you like, what you're confident with, what looks good on you, and what's good for your skin. Um, so I think I did a pretty good job. Uh, if you guys like my videos, go ahead and subscribe, turn on the notifications. If you guys have any questions, I will try my best to answer them. 